We left slam dunk yesterday, but I don't know, I was just tired, it was the end of a long day. We left early, so we didn't see Panic at the Disco, who were like the headliners, so that we could catch the train home a bit earlier and not be in the big rush of people. I'm sad to have missed them because I love Panic at the Disco, but I saw them in January and I'm seeing them again in November, so it'll be fine. Tonight, I'm off to another show. We're going to see water parks. These are the tickets here. This is our like concert board. I don't know if you've ever seen it in the background of my videos, but like. I write all our shows on here that we're going to and then cross them off when they're done. I think it's actually July, not June. My bad. So yes, tonight is Water Parks. Looking forward to that. They played at Slam Dunk, but um, we went to see another band instead because we knew that we had tickets to see these guys tonight. So that's good. I did, however, buy a Water Parks t-shirt at Slam Dunk. It says, I really didn't want to like Water Parks, which I think is really cool. And Mark said that it's dumb because people aren't going to know it's a band and they're just going to think that I'm talking about, you know, water parks, like the theme park, but I think that's why I like it. I think it's cool. So I've been off work for like a whole week and I've just been through all my emails and stuff. There wasn't actually that much to deal with, which was really nice. But yeah, today I'm still not going back to the office because we're having like a marketing team day out. I feel though, like, I don't know, I haven't looked at my to-do list for several days and for me, that is weird and that means that I'm like not feeling on top of my life like just whatever's going on we go to VidCon like we leave for our LA trip I think it's in like 23 days or something which is insane I'm very excited but getting kind of stressed at the amount of stuff that I have to like organize before then because obviously I need to do a lot of filming to make sure that videos go up while I'm away and I've run out of videos like saved in my bank so I don't have one filmed for Saturday so I need to sort that out at some point this week so this week is going to be about getting back on track, I think. Uh, the workshop that I did on Sunday in Bradford went really well. It was a vlogging workshop, so I was talking to people who were interested in starting a YouTube channel about running a YouTube channel and giving them some tips and advice as much as I could. Uh, I was worried that people like wouldn't want to talk and things. You know how sometimes you can get a group of people and they'll be like really quiet and like no one raised their hand or whatever? But everyone was really talkative and yeah, it was great to chat to people because that's really fun to talk to people about stuff they're passionate about and I hope that it was useful to them and anyway I'm going to be writing like a longer overview wrap up thing on the blog so that'll be linked down below when it's done I'm going to try and have it done by the time this vlog goes up so yes committing to that yeah it's going to be a busy week so I'll keep you updated on how I'm going and yeah how I'm getting things done right now though I'm off to brunch in the rain <laughs> both down below you should definitely check out water parks they're really good live and barfly in london is such a good venue it always sounds good every single show i've been there has been really awesome it's built quite quite small it feels really intimate good show Thank you. 
everybody, it's Friday. Um, I fully intended on vlogging on the way home on Wednesday and then again that evening. I don't know why I didn't, I think I just forgot and then on Wednesday evening I was not feeling great to be honest. I hopped into bed at like 8.30 and watched like one episode of a TV show and then went to sleep. And I think I just needed to catch up because yeah feeling a bit exhausted. Tonight I'm off to another gig I think. I'm going to see Gospel Youth which will be really fun. Um, they're like supporting another band called Hands Like Houses or something I think. I might have just mixed two band names together then but anyway I'm going to see the Gospel Youth and I'm wearing, let me show you my t-shirt in the mirror. I'm wearing this t-shirt that says Rome Suck. So Rome is a band, a UK like pop punk band that you've probably seen me go to a few shows of in previous vlogs. I really like them. Uh, they had some hard luck recently. They lost, they had their passport stolen, their van broken into, they got a flat tire, I don't know. All the stuff that they've had to like pay to fix or get replaced or whatever. And it meant that they were running low on funds and looking looking like they weren't going to be able to make it to Warp Tour. So they brought out these t-shirts as a way to like do some fundraising because they got like a cheap deal on the printing and stuff. And I just think it's hilarious that the band put out a t-shirt that says this. So I bought it and now I'm wearing it to the show. I don't know, I just think that's funny. Anyway, I'm running super late. It's like already 9 o'clock. I'm not even left the house. Uh, what else do I need? Phone. Yes. And pocket. I need a jacket of some sort. I don't know why I'm vlogging this. Um, I'll go with this guy because it's cold outside. Okay. Um, computer off. I'm not going to take my headphones. I should take my umbrella because London has not realised that it's summer. Because it's find Victoria's pop-up shop in the fro. She's a YouTuber that I really like and she's joined up with the British Heart Foundation to do a pop-up shop apparently. So I'm just gonna go try find it and see if I can find some bargains, support the cause, etc. Oh, super cute. I think it's still on for like at least another week, I'm pretty sure, because it was like Monday to Friday hours on the website. So uh, go check it out in London, it's at 37 Neil Street. There's loads of great stuff there. I picked up a play suit that I'm hoping I can pull off, I don't know. I'm going to insert a little clip of me trying it on at home here for you to see. Tell me what you think down below. But anyway, it was only like £7 and it's a good cause, so I'm happy. I wanted to be able to have a lion today because I've had such a busy week but instead I got up and have been working on this DIY. Ta-da! These are my coasters. The video showing how to make these would have already gone out because I need to put it up today, the day that I'm filming it. I never do this. I'm always trying to plan in advance of videos but I ran out. It just happened. Uh, I need to make sure I catch up again before I go overseas to America soon. So today, well, this weekend is going to be like a video organization weekend I think. Right now I'm just making a cup of tea to put on the coasters in a few shots and then I've got to film like the talking bit and then edit it all and then later on today I'm going to go down to the mall I think and try and pick up a few more things that I need for like just summer in general I guess. It's time to go home now It's time to go home DIY video in one day, but I'm never going to leave it that late again because I forgot how much work goes into DIY videos. Like, I sort of don't realise when you're, you know, doing it across several days. Oh, who's this? <laughs> Hi, Maddie! I'll see you tonight for dinner. So anyway, now that is up and don't have to worry about that anymore. I'm on the way to the mall to buy a few things, hopefully. I'm on the hunt for some shorts that actually fit me and that I feel okay in and it's harder than you'd expect to find a pair. I don't know why. Just, I don't know. It's time to go home now. You are drunk. And I'm so sick of this. Yesterday's trip to the mall ended up not being overly successful. I think I mentioned that I wanted to find a pair of shorts. I found some. But after trying them on at home, they just 
I don't know. I don't like them. They're too short and they're not like loose enough for my liking around the legs. So they are going to go back to H&M. Anyway, right now, oh, also yesterday I bought some gym pants because I joined a gym. What? Yes, I know. Very weird. I'm going to go off to the gym now and meet Mark. He's like showing me how to lift weights and things because I'm not very good at that stuff. But yeah, my gym that I joined also does classes and things, so I might do like a spin class next week before work or something. I'm going to work it out. Because all of yesterday was taken up with getting that video done, which I'm so glad it did. It's gone down well. People seem to be enjoying it. Make sure you check it out. It'll be linked down below if you haven't seen it already. But yeah, because I was focused on that, I didn't really get to focus on other things. There's a lot left to do today. It's not going to be a very relaxing weekend. That's okay. We'll go to the gym and that should hopefully set a good tone for the rest of the day. I'm sure this lighting is not at all flattering but this is going to be the end of the vlog. Had a busy day but I still didn't get everything done that I needed to do. That always happens though. I don't know why I always think that Sundays will like magically expand to fill and fit whatever I needed to but anyway got the main things done which was the podcast show notes and the plan for a sponsored video coming up that I had to send off to be approved and things I'll tell you guys more about that next week if it does end up being approved right now it's like 7 30 ish I think I'm not actually wearing a watch so I don't know why I looked most but I'm gonna probably wind down for the night now watch a movie and get an early night to get back on track for next week Definitely feeling a lot better than I did at the start of the week, so that's good. And I still managed to get some stuff done. So, all in all, good week. Hope you guys had a good week too. Give this vlog a thumbs up if you enjoyed seeing my week. I think that's it. I think that's all I have to say. I have a feeling this vlog was a long one, so my apologies. Well done, you, for staying to the end. And I will see you next week. Bye.